Hi guys, welcome to the Orange Coder. In this video, we are going to see a new topic that is called Hide and Seek. You must have played the game Hide and Seek with your friends, right? So this is similar to that game as you saw it first. So let's go ahead and see that how we can play Hide and Seek in the Scratch. So for that, first we will go to the scratch.mit.edu, then we will click on the create then this page will appear so after that let's take a sprite so let's delete the sprite and take a another sprite from the sprite library you can go ahead and draw a sprite or you can go ahead and draw a and upload a sprite it's up to you so let me take giga okay and i'll take the backdrop from the backdrop library let's search which backdrop we will take okay let's take this one okay and now let's make it small the sprite because sprite is little bigger as compared to uh, the stage so for that let's make it to 50 yes that's correct so after that what we will do as you can see that when i will click on the green flag then the giga will appear and disappear uh, and then when you will click on the giga then the score will increase so for that first we will go ahead and take that from the event when the green flag is clicked so let's take it so when the green flag is clicked it will appear and disappear so for that we are going to use hide and show block so where it is hide and show we will get it from the looks once i'll click on the looks so i will see that where is the hide and show so once we'll click on the looks we will go down so once we'll go down we can see that show and hide so let's take it hide and show so it will hide and show but we want first it will hide then it will wait for some time then it will show so for that we will go to the control and we will use the wait block so that it will wait for one second then it will show then again let it wait for again one more second so let's see that whether it is so it is yes it is hiding and it is showing again it will hide and it will show as soon as i will click the green flag okay that's correct now after that what we will do so it will it is hiding and showing in the same place i don't want it will hide and show in the same place i want it will hide and show random places so for that what we will do it will go to the random position so where we will get that random position it will go means it will move so for that we will go to the motion block in the motion we will see that go to random position so we will use it go to random position now let's see whether it is going random yes now see it is going to random position it is appearing and disappearing yes that's correct now next is it is going to the random position hide and show in the one time so i want it it will do it for forever for that i will go to the control block and i will take forever block and i'll use it so i'll click it let's see see it is going appearing again disappearing or it is hiding and showing yes so now let's stop it now we will use a variable called score okay so score why we will use the variable called score here okay so now till this much it is done now what we will do first we will go uh, first it will show then it will suppose i will okay suppose i will click on get green flag okay now if i will stop it now the sprite is not showing right so because of that what we will do we will go to the looks first we will use the show where it is okay so first it will show and let it save uh, okay 
okay we will use the uh, speak button speak means say here so let it say click me to score points okay now let's see it will show and it will tell click p to score points now it is going different places and it is hiding and again it is showing so now let's stop now we want the score so for the score we need a scoreboard right so where we will get that score for that we will use one new block from the block palette that that is called variable so we will go to the variable here and here we will be creating a variable so we will click the make a variable and we will write score and we will click on ok now here the score will appear so score it is a variable so what does it mean by the variable so it's a storage and it contains the values and the storage has also some name like here like score it's a storage in the storage score we can keep the numbers like 0 1 2 3 4 whatever score value you will be getting you will be adding it like in your pencil box so like pencil box is a variable inside your pencil box whatever things are there that is the value of that variable pencil box right so that is called the variable so here score is the variable and the its value is zero now so first initially we will set the score to the zero so we will take here and add it here when we will click the green flag let my score will be initially zero so my score is zero it will show and it will tell that click me to score the points and then it will go to the random position then it will hide and again it will show now the next one is that when we will click that sprite it will change the score to the one and then let's make some noise like uh, it will play the sound so for that we will go to the event block and we will use when the sprite is clicked so when the sprite will be clicked so what will happen so when the sprite will be clicked again we will go to the variable we will use change and here my variable is there let change to the score because our variable name is score change by one you can give any number if you want once you will click you will get five points then you can give change score by five then after that we'll go to the sound and suppose play sound pop okay now let's try whether it is working or not so yeah, i'll click it it is asking click me to score points okay so now once i i clicked i'm getting the points right i'm not able to get it yes i got it so now you can see here my score is increasing so now let's change few things here it is waiting for one second and again it is wait for one second right so what we will do it is waiting for only one second right so let's increase uh, we will it will not wait for one second let it wait for random second and it will choose from the scratch so for that we will go to the operator block the green color block in that you can see the pick random so that block we will take it and put it inside that one so it will wait for some random second 0 to let's take 0 to 4 second so it will hide then it will wait for 0 to 1 second then it will show for 1 second now let's try how it is working we will click now my score is 0 click me to score points okay oh my god i missed it again i missed i'm just waiting where it is i got two points three four 
five, six, seven, yes let me stop it so my score is now seven so like that all of you can try and play and now it's your turn now all of you go ahead and create the create the skin and just comment below all of your scores how much you got it after playing this for one minute so you can give a timer as one minute and you can play the game and you can tell me the scores so hope you like this video so if you like my channel please like and subscribe and share with your friends and bye see you in the next video